Hello guys, welcome to another video in this series of tutorial on React. In this video, we will learn to add text-to-speech functionality in our React application. Just like in this example, as you can see, here we have a button by name speak. If you observe, when I click on that one, a text will be converted to speech and that will be spoken by using the default speech of the browser's window. Hello. Welcome to text to speech in react application. You can observe this is the voice or audio which is generated automatically by using the react application. This functionality can be used for variety of purposes such as reading aloud a web content, creating audiobooks and providing accessibility for people with visual impairments. There are different ways to add text to speech in our React application. So let's see one of the easiest way to implement this feature in our React application. For that one, let's open a code editor first. Here I have created a separate component by name text to speech for this example. And we have only header as of now in this React application. If you browse this one in browser, you can observe only that header is appearing now. So let's go back to Core Editor. The first step to add text to speech functionality is create a function for that one. Here I will create a function by name handle click. This is a function which will be called on click of a button. Later point of time we will create a button and we will add a click handler to that button. The next step is we will create a variable by name text. This will hold the text which we want to convert from text to speech in this application. So let's add some text within this variable. The next step is we need to use one of the JavaScript's Windows objects property by name speech synthesis. This is an important step which we need to add for this and I'll click function. For that one, first let's create a variable for speech synthesis utterance. For that one, add code constant value is equals to new speech synthesis utterance and it will receive a parameter as we have defined some text here let's add that one within this speech synthesis utterance. Here speech synthesis utterance is a web API interface used in JavaScript for controlling the generation and playback of synthesized speech in web applications. With this speech utterance you can create an instance of speech and by using that we can set various properties such as the text to be spoken, the voice, the language, volume, pitch, rate and different properties of the speech. The next thing which we need to do is we need to use the speech synthesis and call speak property. For that one let add code window dot speech synthesis and add a property speak and within this speak property let's call this value. Here this speech synthesis is a property of global window object in JavaScript. By using this we can interact with the speech synthesis capabilities of the browser, whichever the browser you are using. It provides different methods and properties such as speak, pause, resume, etc. As for this example we are interested in only speak property we have added that one here. Once we have created instance of speech synthesis and added these codes, the final step would be we need to create a button on click of which we need to call this function. For that one, let me add one button within return. For that one, let me add button and I will name this one as speak. And for this button, let's add a handler on click and within curly braces, Let's call this function. Now whenever this button is clicked, this function gets called and within this function, we have created a speech synthesis objects instance so that whatever the text we have defined here, that will be called using this speech synthesis. So let's save this file and go back to browser to preview this application. Now you can observe we got one button by name speak here. So when I click on this speak button, you can observe the text which we have defined there. 
Hello, welcome to text to speech in React application. Now you can observe the text defined in the variable is converted to speech or audio by using this browser. You can enhance your application's accessibility and user's experience with the power of this text to speech in React application. If you want to customize some of the properties like voice, speed of the voice and when it should be played and when it should be paused, those different features can be added on top of this basic feature. So that's it guys for this video. If you like this video, please click on like button, share it with others and subscribe to my channel.